so uh, keeping company info accurate on LinkedIn is really important. So keep your company info accurate. Um, and this is, this is a basic strategy of SEO. So this applies not just to LinkedIn, but to any platforms where you have listings, profiles, and there, there are limitations to what you can do with a lot of websites. Like on a lot of websites, you can't go in and just start pasting uh, the nice notes that your customers sent you as a review. Um, and with some sites, you can't even you know, start driving traffic to get more reviews. Uh, and another example of where it's really tough is with Wikipedia. You can't uh, necessarily go and just start putting a lot of sales content on Wikipedia. It'll get struck, struck out right away. But there is something that you can have a lot of control over uh, that you need to have a process in to review monthly or quarterly and make sure you have really good discipline about. And that is your basic business info. This is going to include your hours of operation, your URL your uh, locations. Um, and then when you get uh, beyond LinkedIn over to places like Google My Business, they're adding new features like um, ways that you can interact or use services uh, during the pandemic. So think about uh, LinkedIn as an anchor and a, and a real primary point of contact for your customers understanding the basics about what you're doing but you can also extrapolate this kind of thinking out to your other channels and we really recommend um, at a minimum uh, once a quarter doing just a, a check and and having uh, a list of all the different URLs or the, all the different accounts that somebody just needs to go and put eyeballs on and make sure okay and then for just making sure seeing how you appear in search results uh, doing doing a check on schedule at least once a month. Uh, so going out to Google and doing a search, and so this could this could include something like your company name plus the word LinkedIn, and seeing how that looks in search results, or your company name, and then looking at your Google My Business profile, or your company name in your city if you're a regional or, or local provider. So thinking about keeping company info accurate, this is really important. Um, we often think of LinkedIn as one of the things that the CFO is going to go through before they sign the big contract. Uh, it's, it's a little bit of a place to see if people have their stuff together. If they're organized, if they're managing proactively their, their listings and their presence on the internet. And you really don't want uh, that CFO who has veto power over your million dollar proposal to um, go through and say, yeah, this is a little sloppy. You really want them to have no catch, no concerns, uh, no unclaimed listings, no uh, weird uh, errors or an old URL and you know if it oh yeah it redirects it's no problem we use it for our email or something no 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 whatever your marketing face is have everything really clean and tight and populated on your LinkedIn profile that's great 